Hypotrix lanata is a moth of the family Noctuidae. It is found from southeastern Arizona, Chiricahua, Huachuca, and Santa Rita Mountains, southward to the state of Durango and northern Mexico. The length of the four wings is 15 to 17 mm and the wing span is about 31 mm. Adults are on wing from late May to mid September, probably representing two generations. It is a relatively large moth that is superficially unlike any other species in North America. The forewing is a hoary gray with a large entirely black crescent-shaped reniform spot that is fused posteriorly with a black orbicular spot. It is most closely related to Hypatrix quindiensis, Drought, 1924, that was originally described as a form of H. lanata, it occurs from Colombia to Peru. Hypatrix lanata differs from H. quindiensis in having a smaller orbicular spot, the two sides of the black mark formed by the fusion of the spots are similar in size in H. quindiensis, the post-media line is an even black line, an irregular series of black dashes in H. quindiensis ending in a black spot on the costa, the basal line is obscure, a contrasting black spot in H. quindiensis, and the hindwing is fuscous, not dirty white. In the genitalia of H. quindiensis there are two rather than three coils in the vesica and appendix bursi and only the posterior half of the ductus bursi is sclerotized. Hypotrix purpurigera and several of its South American relatives also have black reniform and orbicular spots that are frequently fused posteriorly, creating a wide V-shaped mark. Within the North American fauna the male genitalia of Hypotrix lanata are most similar to those of Hypotrix huaco, but differ in that only the apical part of the uncus is expanded in H. lanata whereas the apical two-thirds is wide in H. huaco, the clasper is stouter and abruptly tapered apically in H. lanata, and the dorsal lobe on the sacculus is much larger. The vesica is very different from that of H. Hueco and having much more extensive basal cluster of spines and subbasal cornuti and a longitudinally rib basal swelling, and the vesica has three tight medial coils rather than one as in H. Hueco. In the female genitalia, the appendix bursi has a corresponding three coils to those in the vesica, and the ductus bursi is more heavily sclerotized. 